We spent 100 days in a room together, and today we reunite to answer all of your questions. All of them are on the same subject. Yep, but there's a couple that actually ask unique and individualized questions. So we're gonna answer those today. Can I get 20 bucks? Sure. No, I don't know how I can get it to you. How did you cope with the boredom before you had all the stuff? I did a lot of trick shots in the uh, beginning of the challenge, and they only showed one. We also cleaned a lot, we cooked a lot. Cooking was about the only thing that was really entertaining. Journaling for me Journaling. was like a huge one. Drawing. Yeah, you drew. We each drew a picture every day too that like represented that day. Here's wow, like it's crazy to like see it outside of the queue. It was, there's like a, a three by three, and then it's on both pages. Oh, that's good. When we figured out the TV. Oh, yeah. When we figured out the TV, I drew a picture for that. They were all like topical. Oh yeah, we had a Harry Potter feast. We actually had the chef make us a feast of everything they eat in Harry Potter one night. That helped a lot, because we only got the two journals. So then we started using the can labels, can labels to build more journals. Man, I forgot about that. I mean, I definitely did it, but like I haven't thought about it. Yeah, no, I haven't thought about like what we had to do to like survive. Yeah. How tall is Bailey in person? And someone named Bayfield asked this. I asked this one because I just like to brag. I'm 6'3". Like the entire team is all giant, so I look tiny on screen. Right. Hardest part of the challenge. The power being on was pretty rough. As far as like difficulty, it was just like... It was just like extreme boredom. Yeah. And... Like mental challenge. Can't... Yeah, because we were just incapable of being normal. Yeah, power out was rough because we had the cold canned food. Honestly, the power out for me was the hardest period during the challenge. It was just really tough to be in darkness all the time. And we were like pretty happy people up until that point. But I yeah. feel like that's where we were like, okay, we're close now because it's like getting tough in here. And then when the so. power came on, it was like a luxury to have our cans like warm. Yes. Like warm cans because... are like a luxury. So we didn't have hot food, so we were eating the cold canned food, which was still like edible, just like barely. We had a cold shower or no shower at all. Yeah, or just didn't shower. <laughs> because the water was freezing because the hot water heater had to be plugged in. Are we returning to a new Mr. Beast video? We already have. There's a chance we're a little cameo. What was the worst thing that happened during the 100 days? The losing the Teslas. I think the Teslas were the worst. Because it was also day 60, so it was 10 days after we saw families. So like- And it was It was like a low, a low point, and then we were thinking like, oh, we get something fun. No, it got lower. It got so much worse. Did I complain? So they say I complained for nine days. I feel like- I don't think it was that long. I what do you it think? It depends on how you uh, like define complaining, because you could argue up until the lat, like till day 100. <laughs> 40 days. Bailey, you're supposed to defend me I mean, in this moment. She wasn't that bad. But I wouldn't bring it up every single day for the rest of the challenge. But you were like, I wonder if they're gonna give us Teslas on day 100. Yes. I knew day 100 wouldn't be a letdown regardless. I actually, it took like weeks after for me to rethink like, oh yeah, I thought there would be Tesla. I can't believe there wasn't a shot of our face like as we walked out. I know. Because I, I know. Feel like I feel like- You were in shock. I was actually in shock. Really? Yeah. Because I mean, I anticipated all the guards and like all the people being out there, but nothing could like prepare you for so for many people. For seeing that many people after seeing, seeing no nobody. one for over three months. Like it's, it was like really overstimulating. Mm -hmm. My body didn't know how to react. And then our families were on the opposite side. Like yes. I walked out left. So it was like right. a mess. So they like crossed paths. I know, and... I know. That was funny. Dang, I also, when we practiced walking out, we were gonna do like a little oh, dance. We did, we practiced to step over the line and then dance and then keep going. Cause there was like the line and then also the doors to the front of the building. That completely yeah. went out the door. Dang. I knew I it would though. What do I have against Monopoly? What do you have against Monopoly? There was just other things to do. Like? In the box. Like what? Like watch movies. And read the Harry Potter books because I was in a time crunch to finish those. So oh, excited. and where'd I hide the dice for Monopoly? I can't believe they didn't show it. I know. I thought it was pretty clever, but I put them in the DVD case for the notebook because he refused to watch it with me. Never found him until she said, if you would have just watched the notebook and they were inside of there. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's talk about Splitter Steel. Did you think about doing it like at all? Like, was there a percentage of you that you were like, you know what, think about maybe it. I should just steal it. I didn't think about it, but I was, like almost a piece of me was like, imagine I do it for the bit and then like <laughs> Venmo you after. 
Oh. I, mean, I guess I should ask you. Did you think about stealing? Yeah, it? I was like. I didn't think about it as like an actual like I wasn't gonna it wasn't gonna happen. But imagine imagine we both were like for the bit. It'd be kind of funny if we both stole it and then we did but the double steal and then nobody gets it. Yeah, see that's we could never do that. Mm -hmm. Everybody would also hate us. Oh, that's so true. Yeah, how to be canceled by the world? The entire world is steal money in a Mr. Beast video. Mm -hmm. But you know what would have happened? Mm -hmm. Say you like actually stole the money, or I actually stole the money. A hundred percent, I think Jimmy would be like, "All right," and this person gets double. Like the person who walks away with nothing. There's no way Jimmy would let. I don't know. Maybe I think Jimmy's nicer than he is. He's a nice guy. <laughs> Obviously, but, he also but like you make it that we would be like cordial. Did Bailey's feet smell bad? Were you ever close enough to my feet to be able to tell? Only when your dogs were out. Nah, dogs. Only was... when those dogs were barking. I was so far away. The only bad smells were the food. That's true. Like, like every time Jimmy would come in, he like... would say how awful yeah. it smelled. I found personally after the video, everyday decisions were actually really hard. Like yeah. I know everyone's making jokes like, oh, well, we keep wearing the blue outfit and stuff like that. But it's like, no, we actually had a hard time making decisions about outfits. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Did you guys? Yes. Oh, go ahead. Sorry. The question is, did you guys get sick of each other? Yes. There's no way you didn't get sick of me at some point. Yeah. Okay. No, I'm not. Yeah. But I don't think it was, it was never bad. And it, also it was probably... shockingly like no issues. Yeah, I think we knew when to be quiet and give each other space also. Mm -hmm. When did the challenge start? Because I think everyone missed the graphic. the graphic that shows the calendar. It was the end of July to the beginning of November. And also a lot of people were asking me by stalking my Instagram, they realized my last post and then my post after the box. There was only 81 days between those. And that's because before the box, I scheduled Instagram posts to prove that social media is fake and no one really knew I was gone, except for my family. The no phones thing wasn't actually that bad. I thought I would miss it, but it was really just to be able to talk to my parents and like friends where I actually missed it. There was parts that were kind of nice. It was. Having I no kind of- social media and not worrying about social media. I kind of miss it in a way. Because <laughs> you honest. can't do that. Like it literally doesn't exist right now. No, it's impossible. Especially, yeah, especially post video. Okay, what are each of our plans for the future? I want to keep posting videos. I still edit videos for some of my friends. And that's about it. Definitely just YouTube videos. And maybe other social media stuff. But YouTube is definitely my main focus. Would you do a 100 challenge again? That's a hard one. That is a hard one. Maybe for more. It would be tempting for more money. But I also feel like I've already, cause like doing the 100 days oh. was like the, getting it done was the accomplishment part. The doing it again, I don't feel. Yeah. How much different would it be to say, I survived 100 days in a place and then just say, I survived 100 days twice. It doesn't really, it's like. Yeah, it doesn't hit, it's like, wow. Like Milly. I think it'd be tempting if maybe it was like with you, so I could know it's like a comfortable thing. Ooh, if you had to get a new yeah, stranger. Like, I don't think I would do it if it was another stranger. Yeah. But I feel like I would do a challenge video where it's like maybe we're in control, mm. like grocery store. Are y'all dating? Uh, yeah, just like stick around.